Hello, how to solve for a and b in this equation a plus b is equal to 7, a b is equal to 12. Solution. a plus b is equal to 7. Let's call this equation 1. Then a b is equal to 12. Let's call this equation 2. From equation 1. a plus b is equal to 7 then b is equal to 7 minus a let's call this equation 3 from equation 2 a b is equal to 12 let's substitute for b a bracket 7 minus a is equal to 12. a multiplied by 7, 7a minus a multiplied by a, a square is equal to 12. minus a square plus 7a, if we bring this 12 to this side, become minus 12. Is equal to 0. Let's divide all through by minus 1. Minus a square divided by minus 1. This is a square plus 7a divided by minus 1. This is minus 7a. Minus 12 divided by minus 1. This is plus 12 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this using quadratic general formula or factorization method. One, let's use quadratic formula first. Then we have A is equal to minus B plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a then from this equation a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 7 c is equal to 12 a is equal to minus bracket minus 7 plus or minus square root of minus 7 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 12 then everything divided by 2 multiplied by 1 a is equal to 7 plus or minus square root of minus 7 square that is 49 minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 12 that is 48 then everything divided by 2 multiplied by 1 2 and this is 7 plus or minus square root of 49 minus 48 that is 1 everything divided by 2 then a is equal to 7 plus or minus square root of 1 is 1 divided by 2. Then this is 7 plus 1 divided by 2 or 7 minus 1 divided by 2. A is equal to 8 divided by 2 or 6 divided by 2. Therefore, A1 is equal to 2 year 1, 2 year 4. 4. Or A2 is equal to 2 year 1, 2 year 3. These are the values of A. We've gotten the value of A. Let's solve for B. To solve for B, from equation 3 
b is equal to 7 minus a then b1 is equal to 7 minus a1 is 4 b1 is equal to 3 this is the value of b1 also b2 is equal to 7 minus a2 is 3 then b2 is equal to 4 therefore our final answer are a1 comma b1 is equal to 4 comma 3 then a2 comma b2 this is equal to 3 comma 4 you can see that the value of a1 here is equal to the value of b2 here and the value of b1 here is equal to the value of a2 here then let's solve using factorization method Now from a square minus 7a plus 12 is equal to 0. We look for two numbers such that the product will be equal to the 12 which is constant and the sum will be equal to the coefficient of a which is minus 7. Then here let's see the product p is equal to minus 4 multiplied by minus 3 then this is equal to 12 now let's see the sum this is minus 4 minus 3 and this is equal to minus 7 so we can now replace this minus 7a by minus 4a minus 3a. Then our equation become a square minus 4a minus 3a plus 12 is equal to 0. Then here we have a bracket a minus 4 minus 3 bracket a minus 4 is equal to 0 then here we have a minus 4 bracket a minus 3 is equal to 0 then you can see that there are two cases here we have a minus 4 is equal to 0 or a minus 3 is equal to 0 now here a is equal to 4 and here a is equal to 3 these are the values of a now to solve for b to solve for b then from equation 3 we already know that b is equal to 7 minus a now when a is equal to 4 b1 is equal to 7 minus 4 this is equal to 3 when a is equal to 3 b2 is equal to 7 minus 3 and this is equal to 4 therefore a1 comma b1 is equal to 4 comma 3 then a2 comma b2 this is equal to 3 comma 4 so you can see that we still get the same answer i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel. Bye.